Well, hello everyone and welcome back to this Let's Play Victoria as Espanol! If you remember from last time, we were having a nice way over time with shortage of silk. We can sort that, we've got some places we can go with silk. I think down here. We were having a way over time as a Spanish game. Definitely want them all in iron frame buildings. Just good. Like technology. After we've done. Oh wow, we're already on percussion cap. Wait, does that mean we've already got the atmospheric engine? I thought I said to do atmospheric engine. We do already have it. That is glorious. I didn't realise we'd flying through it so fast. Maybe it will be better to build, stack them up then because before I remember I was constantly changing it so it was felt pointless doing it. But um, Society, colonisation, quinine. Yeah, oh yeah, we're way too far away from then. Yeah, I was wanting to get my colony stuff up. I think maybe... Mm. Getting down to dynamite could be helpful for our mines once we've got explosives and all that set up. So yeah, we'll do that afterwards. Construction. Yeah, we're flying through these buildings and that's all good. Oh, trains actually build a... Actually, mm, we'll put that afterwards. There's trains again. Is it in production? There it is there. Buildings. Coal mines are not done yet, but they will be soon. We can put them straight to atmospheric engine as soon as they're done. That'll give us more fabric and fertilizer, which we could use to get some of these. 130 more. How much fertilizer are we getting from this? Enough for that. Easily enough for that. Soil enriched there. That'll make grain cheaper. Nearly have enough fertilizer to do that too, actually, which would be really good. Yeah, getting the gold mines up to atmospheric engine as well would also be amazing. They're all in dies. Getting them up to leaded would be great. Getting them up to sulfur would be great too, but we need some sulfur. We'd need the sulfur. Right, how is our infamy? Nearly down already. I think we're going to keep just bullying Japan. Colonization of South Cameron was complete. Happy days. Right, we definitely want to colonize the rest of here now. Because we've got the rights to there. Incorporate here now. We've got just enough to get it done at the same time without causing any problems. So that's all good. Look at the population. We've got population here for days. It's glorious. One free university. I would love a free university. All right. Tools, iron, wood. Yeah, it's all the same stuff. We're low on convoys now, though, because we've got a lot of stuff over here and a lot of stuff over here. We're needing a lot of convoys to get between us. Though, because we're Spain, we started off with a lot of convoys, so that's really good. It takes a lot of transportation to get all the goods from here and deliver goods to here and from here. and Yeah. Yeah. Have to transport like paper from here all the way over to there and stuff just to feed this first stuff over here and yeah. Is France starting to try and colonize the Sahara. The French want to be a rival in our colonial colonial efforts. Well, we knew that was going to happen. Just I didn't expect it to be here so fast. I thought we had more time. We can see the Kingdom of France is uh, colonizing a lot down here. I would love to get big enough that we can bully France. But Britain is definitely first on our hit list if we do get that big, because then we can take over Portugal, we can get our little tiny Gibraltar back, 
And France might be really helpful in helping us if we can do that. If we can get strong enough that France want a pure alliance, we could then maybe start a war goal to take here and he these three places all in the one war goal and hopefully France would not abandon us and Yeah. And then we'll be laughing, laughing, laughing I say. GDP's doing good. We're going to be getting the coal mines in a second, that'll really help. That will really help. Then we're going to need. Where is sulfur? We're going to need some lead as well, aren't we? So we need some lead. There's got to be some sulfur somewhere, right? There's some sulfur. Yeah, plenty. So then we've got that. We're going to want some chemical factories. Then we're going to want some munitions factories. Let's take a look. Infrastructure here is plenty. That's great. That's great. Yeah, that'll be great. And once we've got those built, we can hopefully go up the next level. How are we actually doing? Gun-wise, I know we were importing some guns in our arms industries. Just take a look. Can you see the guns? In no, they're not too expensive. We are importing a lot, though, so yeah. Oh, hello, Britain and France are at war. Looks like America. Is that... What flag is that? It looks a bit like the American flag. Nope, that's not the American flag in this game anyway. I'm not sure what flag that was. We'll do the... We'll, try, we'll help out, we'll do the expenses, we've got a lot of money in the bank, and we've got low taxes and stuff, so that's all good. That's all good. We can afford it. Fertilizer is expensive at the moment. We do really want those feral the chemical farms to help out with that. That big tool's way too expensive. What else can we play around with? What else can we play around with? We're going to want to go straight to explosives right off the get-go. I wish we had lead to go to leaded glass right now and then go to ceramics. That would help out. That would help out. We don't have the iron to spare there. Infamy is back to zero. Why are we not at war then? I'm guessing. Improving relations with Britain. Yeah, they're calling for help. Right. Da -da 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 -da. Conquer state. They want there. Or I mean, would be this. Oh, China may. Oh, China may side with the enemy. That's problematic. China. Have a lot of... Yeah, we're going to need to... Okay, we need to bully someone else for now. Take a look at the diplomacy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, let's bully someone else for now. Who should we call that? Hmm. That's really close to... We could conquer Congo and that's we could join these two up if we colonize it. Yeah, that'd be good. We'd have Portugal. Portugal's conquering some of here. Good to know. Good to know. I think that would be a good little place just to get a wee bit in for me. Mobilize this guy. Stick one in front 
there. Thanks to them, we don't even need to naval invade. Thanks to Portugal. Thank you, Portugal. And it'll only be a tiny bit of infamy. Eight. Yeah, that'll go down really quick. We really need to get our weapons technology up, so I'm really just not caring about uh, China joining the enemy. Are they going to back down? I wouldn't be surprised, but I would be at the same time, because it's the only place to arms. They're just going to get absolutely raffle stomped. They're outnumbered so much, and our quality is so superior. Boom. Boom. Done. care about the relations. Let them get worse. Oh wow, look, this is a nice little area to get. It has a lot of stuff for us. Boom. First things first, get that to a cargo port. That's a nice little addition for us. A very nice little addition. Though it's going to be more of a strain on our convoys. Though we've also built a port, so actually it may actually help our convoys. Spanish Bass Congo. Are these... Decentralized, yeah, 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 okay, we can. That's co colonizable lands, not things like that, okay. Good. Who are you? It'd be nice to conquer at some point. And save us from to colonize Abraham. Mm. Did not know we're needing a new interest. Incorporate. We're gonna to need to do something about our bureaucracy soon. Definitely want one there. Did not realise our colonial efforts here had finished. Says trade agreement, France. What's a trade agreement? Oh, decline. Decline. Oh, yeah, finally, we can colonise here or here. You know, what, let's start there because that blocks more people from joining. Oh, France has already joined there fully, but oh well. If France hadn't already colonized here, that'd have been perfect, because, yeah. If we could sort of, like, build, like, a line around here. Who's doing an uprising against us now? Some guy with one little unit. This little guy here, we literally just... Oh, wait, oh, this guy, I see now. I see now. It's not, it's, he's bigger than I thought. We'll do the two. Literally, I just started colonizing here. Stop slowing down my colonial efforts elsewhere. Yeah, we'll get a free university. It's worth it, giving them extra political power. Right, actually, we've been on speed up quite a while. I bet you we've got lots of coal mines with nothing for coal to use. Yeah, we've got four coal mines using atmospheric engine. They should be on that. Coal input. Coal shoot up skyrocket now. We've got four. Now what we really need is more tools. If only we could just jump up to steel somehow when we don't have steel. Nitro 
whistler. Nice. stuff to get through still. So much more tools. So much more tools. Now, does this give us colonial rights, and so France can't have them? It'd be great if it did. I don't think it does. Oh, our infamy is back to zero. Where is our interest that's disappearing? Ah, oh, here. There we go. Put it back. Put it back. colonize this nice and fast our money is doing good oh, I think we're gonna be nice and powerful yeah, I'm a wee bit worried about how much power they're gaining We should improve relations here, they'll be less likely to help. Japan. Just may side with the enemy. Yeah, if we get them to like us more, we would have Portugal and the Spanish Philippines to help us. The little Spanish Philippines here. I don't think we've actually taken a look at them at all yet. Hmm. Nice hardwood throughput. France and France and Russia are duking it out by the looks of things, or France and Prussia. Or is France and Austria? Austria, I think. Yeah, it's Austria's flag. I'm derping just gonna like plug. Plug there. Yeah, let's improve the relations there. It's poor, so that'll be good. Improve relations there, we're gonna improve relations there still. Oh, we need to incorporate there. We really need more construction sectors too. Oh, we need so much stuff. We need so much stuff. You know what? Let's say uh... we've got lots of money. We've got really low taxes and stuff. Let's just come in. And let's just go bam, bam, bam. Let's splits through these buildings. It's going to make wood even more expensive and iron even more expensive. We'll see if we can import some from somewhere. Tools. Oh yeah, we've got no infamy. We should be invading somewhere. Don't forget. Conquer states, what we got, what we got, what we got. I was hoping somewhere we wouldn't need the naval invade, but. What's this? <coughs> Netherlands owns there. That would suck. Hmm. I don't really think there's any real great options right now for invading. Down here, like take over the Zulu, start taking over some land down here. Still, it's not ideal. We'd have to naval invade it. Uh, it's better than not getting it anywhere. We'll do it. We'll naval invade it. We'll, uh, blah, blah, blah. we'll that guy and we'll 
navel and beat him. Okay, so we got power projection. Oh wait, what? We have a front with him? We have a front with him! Oh, that's fine! That makes this good! Where's the guy mobilized? I'm guessing Portugal! Thank you, Portugal! Portugal, you're a great ally to have right now when I'm trying to conquer all these little places. Okay, the other guy is side of him. We're gonna get another army ready then. And you know what we're gonna do then? We're gonna add war goal, conquer state, boom. Now we're infamous, so we're gonna need to back off doing anything else for now. When they get there, one building using ammunition. What building's using ammunition? I shouldn't be using any ammunition yet. Oh wait, you know what it probably is? It's probably my vassals started to get skirmish infantry and it's my market. Yeah, yeah, I'm not paying for skirmish infantry when I don't even your skirmish infantry when I don't even have them yet, mate. You can wait. You can wait. Yeah, the border gore in Africa is gonna be one hell of a mess. To arms! Oh, I forgot to make their a primary goal, but oh well. Yeah, curb stomp both of them. Happy days. Huh? I realise we had a little second war going on over here. Though it does look like our side is winning. You know what? Let's just, uh, just to make sure we don't lose a vassal, let's uh, send over someone to help him out. Send over someone to help him out. Oh, especially how he's losing them. Yeah, hopefully our unit gets here in time just to quickly go boom boom and then turn around and then boom boom. Don't lose too fast. Don't lose too fast. Arrive. How long till they arrive? Come on, don't don't get wiped out too fast. Don't get wiped out too fast. Oh wait, oh, did we win? Did we push them? Oh, it looks like we won. Yeah, we're winning. Oh, that's fine, that's fine. We're pushing them back. Then boom, my unit's here now going dr -dr 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 jumping around, conquering everything. Happy days. Right, how are things here? Going just as well. Right, happy days. Ammunition, I know. No, about it. Yay. Spin! Yay! And this will be finished here soon. Yay! This port. Put up to a cargo port. Ugh, not enough population for that, really. But the population will grow into it. It'll be fine. Right, uh, should be online. Cannon. I'm getting my military is growing in size just from me conquering land, which is good. Though it will make me have a lot of smaller armies, which will be kind of useful to see. Trade unions getting power would be good. That would be helpful. That would be rather helpful. Good. We're gonna get our munitions factory soon, and we can start getting some of these up to skirmish. Then we're gonna be, our power will skyrocket. Let's get that up. As is. Good. We've got lead now. Let's get to the glass. Where's the glass? We go up to leaded glass. Dye is more expensive, but we can get more dyes. Dye 
days here, wasn't it? Yeah, was the population like here? Oh, population for days. Population for days. And days. What we really need is more tools. More iron! Rural. Can we make more of these atmospheric now? Mm, coal, that's not really going to make a difference, really. So, you have coal, iron completely on atmospheric. So, iron's now not a bad price. What we need is a lot more tools and wood. Got tools in the works. What we need is wood. It is wood. It's a hard wood. Where's our. We'll get four there as well, and then we'll just keep it on soft wood. Spanish dream! <laughs> They're starting to like us more. We've got a lot of infamy to get through. Well, not actually that much. We're nearly down it already. Let's just take a look. Yeah. Brilliant. Great Quing no longer hate us, and no longer there. We can go back to bully in Japan when our infamy resets. We've got so many pies all over the world now, with fingers in all of them. We're going to be rivaling Britain soon with our colonial sort of efforts. What we're going to need is a stronger navy. We need a stronger everything. Our GDP is doing lovely. Let's actually just see how Britain's GDP is doing. Oh wow, their GDP is doubled. France, we're, cap mm, we're half of France. 180 China's GDP. The rest of Japan has 16 GDP still, so if we cut gobble up Japan, that'd be great. And then we'd have so much potential here because the population. I should start building up tooling industries, iron industries, and everything industries over here too. Just so it's less infrastructure demand on my convoys. Because a lot. Because the population over here is massive. If we got the population over here, like the infrastructure over here, just as high, so over here supplying itself, I do not need to, for example, transport like everything over here just to make them the same standard as over here. That could be a really good idea because our convoys are going to be a big ordeal later on. We've got a lot. We started off with a lot as we're Spain, and we started off with uh, we've built up them up quite a bit. But we've also gained a lot of new colonies, which are going to have big demands on our convoys. And when we're throwing our army around all across the world, that's going to be the thing again. We already put them down. Right, let's just mobilize. This guy. And you want to mobilize this crew general? Um. Should be one on each. That should solve that problem. Wait a minute. Let's talk to that one. So it should be one on each now. Yep, there we go. That'll be that sorted. Infamy's all gone. You know what that means? As soon as this is done. Japan, I'm coming for more of your land. I think we should build more construction sectors too. But I think we should wait until we got this stuff done because all this stuff is railway. We've got. We don't have railways. How are we building the railway? Okay. I'm not going to complain, but yeah. I am not going to complain one iota. Gobble, 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 gobble. Goodbye, Fang. For two seconds. Boom. 
five, four, three, two, one. Munitions factories are being done and dusted. We'll be able to go in and we'll be able to start moving over some of our army. Some buildings though. Skirmish. Yeah, we can see it's really expensive right now. We need 98 ammunition. We got the colonization rights. Already got the colony there. Let's just make sure the interest's not disappeared. No, it doesn't. At the moment, they're only making four. But if we scaled that up, we probably would be making enough. You know what? Let's bite the bullets. If we go to the right bit. Turn everyone onto skirmish. It's going to say we don't have enough, but because... What is it? Chemical factories. That's going to make explosives cheap, but the explosives are probably going to get a lot more. Right, and also, fertilizer is probably really cheap, so probably can do that. Take a look at the fertilizer farms. How much fertilizer is making? 93. They say I think the explosives are getting. The coal was really expensive. buildings. That'll help out a lot. Alright. What was the other thing we needed to play around with? We've got the chemicals done. Munitions. You can see it's making 120. Is that not roughly what we needed actually? You can see the lead is expensive. Though, we've only got the two lead farms. It's making 40 and it's fully staffed. If we go up to atmospheric engine and just import some coal. Or we could just get another two for now. That would be good. That would be good. Our power projection as well though, with that, should be through the roof. 710. Get in there, get in there. Still nowhere near, just because they've got that many men. Yeah. By the time we conquer the rest of this, our power projection will be brilliant. Right, anyway, that is a part. Hope you have all enjoyed this. I shall see you all next time. Bye, see, bye. we